This is Living Power with Dan Hurst. I love how at the very beginning of this psalm, in the very first verse, David makes such an overwhelming statement of God's grace. And this is what he says, basically. God, you know me inside and out. You know the good and the bad. Even the stuff I've tried to suppress, the things I've forgotten, the things I'm too ashamed to bring out. You know you've been to the darkest corners of my life. And with that statement, we're taken on this beautiful journey of realization. God is so into you that he knows your every move. When you sit and when you walk, he knows and he still loves you. He completely understands your thoughts. Even when you may not understand why you think the things you do, and he still loves you. He knows when you get up in the morning and when you go to bed at night. He knows all about your ways and your habits, even the good ones and the bad ones, and he still loves you. Even before you say something, even if you don't say something, God knows where that's coming from, and he still loves you. He has surrounded you with himself, and even more importantly, he has put his hand on you. You are chosen. You are called. You have a purpose and a destiny because God still loves you. The truth is so amazing to realize, yet too great to comprehend. God, who loves you so much, will meet you anywhere you are. No matter if you are on the mountaintops of life or in the very depths of despair. No matter if you are soaring with eagles at the beginning of a new day or a new chapter of your life or if you are lost and far away. No matter where you find yourself, God is there to hold you and to guide you because he still loves you and he will not let you go. Even if you think it's so dark that God can't find you. Even if you think that you'll never see the light of day again. Know this. There is no darkness for God. And he still loves you. Why? Because he created you. He designed you. He planned you. Think about it. Your body is such an intricate, awesome design. God did that. You didn't just happen. You were made out of nothing. God made something special. You were a secret that God planned and held until just the right time. And he loves you. You are so planned by God that he even planned your days before the first one happened. He has so much invested in you and you are of such great worth to him that he thinks about you all the time. God loves you that much. Looking for a Bible study that's focused on the practical application of the Bible? Check out our website at theopenclass.com. Oh, cry.